Hi, Sarah Banna, Simply Sarah Made Easy. I have something to show you that's really neat today. So this, um, I ordered these on Amazon. I think it was during Prime Days. I'm not sure. I think I think that's when I got them. Um, and in true uh, Sarah Banna's fashion, I got the box in the mail and it ended up, you know, with the rest of my craft stuff and never got opened. So tonight I was going through boxes trying to organize my craft room and um, I came across it. So <laughs> I gotta show you this. I am so impressed. I love packaging. Packaging is a huge deal for me as far as with your crafts and selling them. Um, how you present your product to your customers is that makes a difference and if they're gonna recommend you to their friends. So I love packaging. Like high-end makeup and stuff. I love how like the, um, the makeup will be pressed into like roses when, you know, like the blush will have like, it'll be pressed into roses and stuff like that. Love that. Um, so this, I was so impressed with. This is a, just a craft, um, a craft blank that I ordered, um, or two sets of them. Um, like I said, during, so, so I'm going to do a tutorial on using these in a bit. Um, but let's, let's just, let me show you. So, okay. So this is the one that I have not opened. This one I already did open. Um, and I want to show you this, so I'm keeping this one to the side because I love this one, but I, this one I wanted to show you from it being unopened. I wanted you to see it from the beginning. So look at that. Isn't that so nice? They put the little seal on there. I didn't even read it. What does it say? It says with love. So the, it's just a little like wax seal, but cute, right? So these are, all these are as craft blanks. I didn't pay very much for them at all. So I did, this is packaging surprised me. Look at this. This is like, it's like when you get a nice gift in the mail and it's not, it's just craft blanks. But look at this nice little, look at this bag. I wish, I wish you could feel it. This bag is so soft. I don't, I gotta find out what it's made of because I need an entire wardrobe made of this. This is so soft, but what, what a neat little thing for them to put in there. So little craft bag. Um, put this to the side and then I don't want to get anything on it. Okay. And then it comes with a nice little spool of ribbon. This is the ribbon for, uh, oh, I didn't even pull the other one out. This is so nice. This is like, um, oh, wow. That's nice. That is not what I expected. It's like velvet. It's like a velvet cord to hang it from that. It's really nice. Uh, the other one has the same thing, but I didn't open it. So, oh, you know what? I wonder if I accidentally ordered two of this. Oh, you know what? It's not. It's a different orientation. Okay. So this is what these are. These are ornaments for a tree, right? But what they are, this is so, so neat. And I'm going to be able to, so it opens up just like that, right? And you take this out. It's just placeholder. Oops. Uh, oh, I'm being a little bit rough with that, and it is not hurting it at all. That's nice. Okay, so you take that right out of there, and then you put the picture in there, right? So we can print then cut what I want to use these for. So I want I'm glad I kept out the other ones. I like the other orientation better. The other orientation is like this. So you know the builder sets where it'll have like the three sisters sitting on the pier or it'll have the girl and her dog, or it'll have, you know, somebody important who's passed away with wings, or it'll have the whole family sitting in front of a Christmas scene, like with the little kids and stuff. Those are builder sets, and I love them for, for sublimation. Um, and there's some things that you can do with them for printables, you know, cards and stickers and stuff like that, but this I thought would be perfect to put on the tree if you don't sublimate, and you don't want to sublimate on ornaments, you can do this. So these, let me show you the other ones because the other orientation. So these are going to be so neat. I'm actually going to put this back in here because I don't want to get them all, um, like, I don't know, like fingerprinty, I guess. I don't know if it makes a difference, but I'm going to put that back in there. They're so nicely packaged. <laughs> I'm going to put it back the way it was. See, you see that? I put like a little like piece of tissue paper in between them so they don't get scratched up. I'll link these in the video description. Um, but so, so this is my thought. My thought is this, my thought is that, you know, I'll teach you guys how to use the builder sets. Um, I'll do a video on that really soon. And, um, and if you're a Silhouette user, I already have a video up on how to use it. So just search, search the channel for builder sets. Um, and I already have 
uh, Silhouette Studio video up, but I will make a design space one tonight or tomorrow. Um, here, I'll just get the other ones out and show you the other orientation. So, um, this is my thought. So, you make the builder set, right? So, same thing. Comes in a nice little bag. All right. Without that in the way, I want to show you this bag. Isn't that nice? It's so soft. And it's got like gold. I'd actually like to find out what that vinyl is. Look how pretty that vinyl is. Look sparkly. It's, oh, and look how little they were able to. I wonder what, how they did this. See how tiny they were able to get that text on there? That can't be HTV, right? It's got to be a different process. I wonder what that is. Anyways, let me let me show you these. So this is the other orientation, right? So to complete my thought, what I'm thinking is to take these and put the put the builder set in there, right? Put print then cut a builder set with, you know, whatever, say the whole family um in front of the Christmas tree. I mean, you could do a regular picture, but the builder sets are so much fun and these are going to be perfect for them. So print then cut a nice little image with the, you know, with the whole family in there. They got penguin builder sets. I mean, how cute would that be with the whole family of penguins and then with their names underneath them. And then what I'm thinking to make it even more special is you could take um, a font that has, you know, nice end extenders on it. And what you could do is you could write like, you know, Merry Christmas or whatever and like a specialty vinyl and holographic vinyl or, you know, a, a gold vinyl or, you know, whatever. And you could do that across there and do like, you know, or you could do the year or you could do whatever on top of it. So you could vinyl on top of it. You could print, then cut the builder set and then put something, you know, some kind of special sentiment on top of it um, over the picture. And how pretty is that going to be? So anyway, I just had to show you guys these because, I mean, I'm just so impressed with the the packaging and the product. And I mean, that's they're really nice. Um, and like I said, I'll make that video uh, for the builder set. If, if this type of content is interesting to you, like the video, that helps me out a lot, but also subscribe to my channel. You'll get a notification when the new videos come out, you know, once or twice a week. All kinds of ways to use your Cricut and Silhouette and Sublimation and um, just everything you can think of. Um, we are uh, all crafts. But uh, so, you know, subscribe to my channel, get a notification when the new videos come out. Really, really good series on designing for yourself that we're partway through that you're not going to want to miss out on. Um, but also join us on Facebook. We have some of the largest craft communities on Facebook. Cricket for Beginners is like 775,000. It's like three quarters of a million members at this point. I'll link that in the video description also. Join us there. You'll fit right in. It's such a fun group. Um, and that's it. If you have any questions at all, ask in the videos below, in the, below the video here or you know, right on Facebook. Um, you can find me there, but and this is just, ah, I'm so excited about these. They're so pretty. So I'm going to have to go back and look at the company and see if they have any other, I don't remember seeing any other shapes, but I want to see if maybe they have rounds or, but this is the perfect shape. This specific one, this orientation and this shape, uh, is the perfect one specifically for those builder sets. I'm going to make some really, really neat ones. So stay tuned.